<laughs> okay, ready? One, two, three. Okay. I don't know what we're saying. This is your thing. Three, two, one. Hey, gang. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We just put out our light removal preset pack and since we put it out we've been getting a ton of questions in this video we'll show you how to import the way we like to edit our favorite presets it's super easy now with these presets you could essentially take a photo on your iphone and throw one of these presets on it that we made and make it look super professional make it look amazing literally within the click of a button within seconds so here's some of our most recent work that we've used with our own presets on light removal So yeah, it does work on Android. Android, I heard, is a lot easier yeah. to import with Lightroom. So here's what you all see. So you swipe up on my story, and it takes you to our shop. We're just gonna do the bundle pack since it's easier and it comes with everything. Add to cart, to check out, continue as guest. So you don't need an Etsy account to do this. You can yeah. just go as a guest. Thank right. you for your order. When you get the email after you place the order and everything, you'll get the email from Etsy transactions. transactions. First thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go right here to the FC Summer Pack Zip. So you get this page as soon as you open it up. You go hit More, and then you do Save to Files. Save it to whichever file you want. I'm just gonna click Desktop. Because it's easiest and it works the best. All right, so now once you saved it to your files, you just go here, type in Files, hit that. In the search bar, search up FC. And then that's where your zip file is going to show up. So once you get here, just go ahead and hit preview content to go ahead and save image and these will just go straight into your camera roll. Once you do that and you save them in your camera roll, they'll just show up as gray images right here, which is perfectly fine. That's normal. That's how it ah, should be. Bless me. No. <laughs> <laughs> so you're going to go into your Lightroom app and you're going to have to download this from the app store. It's free, it's easy, it's quick. So I say the first thing I do when I go into my Lightroom app is I'm gonna create a folder. And I'm just gonna label that editing photos. So then from here, I'm gonna create two separate albums, one with the presets and one with my unedited photos that I'm going to eventually edit. So I'm gonna start off with presets, and then I'm gonna add another album, and that's going to be photos. So from here, I'm going to go into my presets album, press the three dots in the upper right hand corner, add photos, camera roll, and then here you'll see it shows up as DNG. So you're just going to click all the DNG files and press add seven photos. So here we have Bahama Blue, Beach Bum, Miami Vibes, Orange Teal, and Sand Dollar, and Sundays. A lot of questions I got, which was my personal favorite and which was his personal favorite, my personal favorite is orange teal. And my favorite is Sundays. You're just gonna go to your top, press the three dots, and press copy settings. There you don't have to change anything, you just hit OK. You just hit OK and everything's perfect. So then you're gonna go back to your photos album, and then you're just gonna go into your camera roll and import any photo that you want to edit. This is a photo Merritt took. And you're gonna press the three dots in the upper right hand corner again and just press paste. Boom. And then boom. It's as simple as that. It's completely edited and it looks great. From there, to save the photo to your camera roll. You're going to press this little icon with a box and an arrow pointing upwards. You're going to press save to camera roll and you're going to click whichever photos you have edited that you want to save and then you're just going to press the check mark and pick maximum available. Now it'll just show up in your camera roll as the most recent photo right there. And that is that. Alright, so the way that works best on my phone is to do the following. When you open up the Lightroom app, I already created the file called Presets. So when you get in here, go ahead and hit Add from Camera Roll. And then right here you can see the DNG files up top. Once these are in your Lightroom app, you go up to the top. And then the three dots, there's a little button under that that says Create Preset. Go in there, go ahead and name it, Bahama Blue. Alright, done. Bahama Blue added to presets. Beautiful. So now, once you go out of there, this is 
is the one photo that I have in Lightroom. You go down here to where it says presets, and then it'll be in this section called user presets all the way at the bottom. Go down there, Bahama Blue, and then boom. Simple as that. As opposed to going in and, and copying all the settings and pasting them, this is the way to do it where you just create the preset yeah. in the actual Lightroom app. So whatever whatever you have, both ways work the exact same. Or it, it depends on if your app's updated or not. So now that you know how to import and get it into your Lightroom, and now the hard part is done, now we're going to show you how to make little adjustments with the preset already on the picture to make it the way that you would like it to look. Yep. We made these presets so they work on all different photos without having to adjust anything at all. If the preset on your photo looks a little bit dark or a little bit light, we're going to show you how to adjust that. Here we have the photo with just the natural preset on it. You're going to go into your light menu and you can play with the exposure. You can bring it up, you can bring it down. And that whole area right there is where all those little adjustments will be that will just make it exactly how you want but like we said before we made these presets to work pretty perfectly as as close to perfect as we could get on all kinds of photos so marla just showed you where to go if you if the photo is a little too dark a little too bright which is all personal preference if it's a nighttime photo or a sunset photo you might have to do that but in nearly all other circumstances the photo should be good as is um but in the other rare case where a photo might be extremely pink or an extremely blue photo, all you have to do is go here to where it says color, and then this is it right here. You got the temperature and the tint, and these two things will fix the pretty much whole photo in general if it's too far to one side. I put something on my story asking you guys like what concerns or questions you have about the presets or about editing them in general. We're gonna go through the most relevant questions as far as presets and stuff go. So one of the most frequent questions that we got was do you need a computer to use these presets? And the answer to that is no. We designed these presets to work specifically on your phone. However, they do work on computers on well. computers pretty much exactly the same so unfortunately we can't do any refunds because it is something that you just download uh, you can't really return it to us once you download it you have it another question that we keep getting is people try I guess they're trying to download it directly from the Etsy app you don't download the preset from the app the Etsy app you download it from your email that you get with the confirmation number and all that our last question is how long are they going to be on sale for? So these presets that we have out right now are going to be on sale forever and ever, amen. But we will have more coming out. Uh, I think we want to drop a few every month. We already have a bunch more that we're working on, so if this goes well and you all like it, then let us know if we should do more in the next coming weeks, right? Yeah. Well, thank you guys for watching this. I hope this was helpful. If you guys have any more questions, drop them down below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. If you didn't find it helpful, don't do anything. Just leave us a comment and we will help cry. you there. We'll cry. <laughs> Down below, we will have our link to our presets where you can buy them. It's super cheap. There's $5 for individual ones and $20 for the pack of six. Which is the price Which is of also four. the price of four, so you're getting a good deal. All right, deuces guys. Have a great summer, hags. Ha <laughs> ha